Dave. Hooks, it's Ritgar here. How you doing? Welcome back to Swag and Sorcery. We have been chilling out a little bit in the hot tub, just recuperating from some of our adventures, and now we're refreshed and ready to get back to it. Right, so we go to the competition. Submit 100 gold right there so that we can go to the competition. Uh, the trendy color is blue. Well, he's got blue. Right there, see, we've got some blue, we've got casual wear, and we've got grunge as well. I didn't realize this. So you can see that, and then you can dress them according to the the colors that they want for the competition. So chances are, I'll send them off. In this competition, we're not going to do so well. Right, I'm, I'm just going to let the competition run through a minute. Uh, six, seven, five. I was going to say, while I have a drink, but I can drink and talk, sort of. Four seven four. That's actually that's only fifteen and six seven five. That's um, four, that's eighteen. That one there, seventeen. Right, we got three to go. Oh, nineteen right there. We're down into second place already. That's not good. That's not good at all. And oh, that's another nineteen. That's eighteen points right there. And this one. Eight, five, six, okay, that's, that was a really good score right there. That was 20 points there. So we, we didn't get anything with either of our characters. Epic fail. Absolutely epic fail. Fourth place and sixth place. But did you see it told us the color that we should be wearing for the competition? I, I noticed that it told us the color that we should be wearing for the competition. So we'll make sure that we put our stuff back on as we want it. Uh, have we got any pine? We have got the pine planks. So uh, you know, first up, let's go. Oh, wait. What's this? What's this? Supplier couldn't deliver cotton to the magic store owner in time. We know he won't be able to complete an order. Can you help him? Give him four cotton. Yes. <gasps> Ooh, Magic Store is very pleased. He gives him return. He gives you a little present. Look at this. That's a blue item as well. Look, it's blue. It's blue. We could have done with that. Required required agility 27. We have got agility way over that. Um, 44 damage is up. 13 agility is up. Fire damage is up. 5 vampirism. I don't know what vampirism does, but I'm assuming it sucks out the um, stuff from them and gives it to us. So we will swap that bad boy over. Look at this. Look at that. That is fantastic. So we've got Aiden over here. He can't wear anything that we've got. Um, I'm kind of hoping. Well. I'm going to bring you down here and I'm going to do a little bit of work. You're going to you're gonna make those pine planks there a second. Right, you've got a couple of them. We've got a library down here that we want to build with three of those. And then we've got the guild over here that we want to upgrade with two as well. There's two pine planks. So we can upgrade this one. We'll do that and that will complete that quest. Build. <laughs> There we go. Yeah, that's why. So that we can upgrade that bit. Well, as you can see, there's not much building space in the village. Yeah, we, we, we know that. Right, complete. Five pine logs. Very nice. Upgraded building six perfectly in the landscape. Now the guild will allow you to send two groups to different places at the same time. And will also increase the status of your village. Close. Right, and you see right there, that will be a third one. So we'll be able to get three of them going as well. That's, that's, that's brilliant. Knowledge is power. Do you know what's wrong with our village? Everyone is completely illiterate. Build a library. You'll be able to conduct research and open up many new opportunities. Right, we need the library down there. So Kazuki, you in here, we've got some more pine logs. Uh, that's actually just enough to be able to do the library, which is brilliant. Um, and then we'll be able to build that one. And... Well, she's doing that, you come over here and you can do this potion of mine healing. There are 16 potions. You can make those. Um, what is his current 12%? It's 12% chance. Right, so we've got three pine planks right there. Build the library. Yes. Okay. So look at this. Do you know what's wrong with our village? Yep, everybody's illiterate. Not anymore. Ooh. Milk. Meh. <laughs> Uh, hey, lady, where's my whiskey and catnip? <laughs> I love whiskey this cat. This is bad for your health. Meanwhile, an unexpected visitor is about to appear in the village. What sort of unexpected visitor? <laughs> Something very good is sure to happen on such a wonderful day. <laughs> uh, 
Oh. <laughs> Empty. What a pity. Okay. I don't have a mirror, but I bet I'm now the greatest beauty in the whole village. Dear old man, do you happen to have a mirror? No, my girl, I have no mirror. Can you tell me, is this the fabled village? Which village? The home of the heroes who seek the king's costume. I don't know, but I think it might be the right village. Who are you? I am a wandering sage. Come here to offer my advice in times of trouble. She seems pleased. Oh, you're just in time. Can you tell me which dress best matches my new hairpin? <laughs> they open a nursing home or something? What's he doing here? <laughs> It's so savage. Old people often possess valuable knowledge, my dear cat. Valuable knowledge? About what? Polyphonic farts? <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, that is genuinely savage. Right. According to your fighters, real heroes go out and fight. And don't sit around reading dusty books. Nonsense. The real heroes are sitting in the chancellery right now, writing out contracts in Oct Topulate. Okay. Only those are the real heroes. Ancient arts. Let's just have a look at this a minute. Uh, essence absorption. 30 seconds. Uh, I'm, just, I'm not, not going to do anything there. Your characters will need all the help they can get if they hope to follow the king's orders. And what could be a greater help than magic? First of all, research essence absorption in the library. Right, now we go to Essence Absorption, so we go there, 30 seconds, 150 gold. Unlocks a gathering of essence from vanquished monsters, which can then be processed into mana in the lab. The stronger the monster, the more essence you can gather from its defeat. Research. Uh -huh. uh. Right, Heavy Hand. I like the sound of this. That's 250 gold. I don't have 250 gold. I've got 227 gold. Okay, I should have a load of healing leaves from you... Healing medallion. We need copper ingots for that. Close. Uh, go up here. At uh, 2,700 for another one of them if I hire a new character. And then I can start sending them off to the forest. Gee, I suppose I could send our two little characters off to the forest a minute. Essence absorption. Complete. Perfect. Who said the books were useless? Now you can collect essence from the monsters you destroy and recycle it in a manner for spells. And a uh, magic store available. I got a uh, magic store one energy collecting. There's the magic store. All right, time to get down to business. Do you still remember the royal decree? Send your heroes out to kill monsters and collect essence. They've grown lazy beyond all reason. Craft 50 points of mana. Power of fire one deals 100 points of fire damage. That's our reward. And the mist is retreating. The mist is retreating a little more. And we'll finally be able to see where we're going. Okay. I like this. I like this a lot. I like this idea. Uh, we need five pine planks to be able to make the magic store. Processes fibers into fabric, which can then be used to make clothes. That is going to be what we're going to need to kit out that dude right there. Aiden right there. We're going to need to... Yeah, he's he's a magic user. I'm sure of it. He is definitely a magic user. I, I've just, I can feel it in my water. I really can. Um, wolf let, so we, He's not going to want leather, is he? He's, he's absolutely not going to want that. Um... So we're going to want to open that one, so then we can get the next bit sort of unlocked after that. Uh, so let's drop you up there. And we'll drop you up there. In here, what have we got? Uh, we've got nothing that we want to do there. Nope, nope, and nope. Um, close. If I got everything... Oh, yeah, we had the Frost Axe. Um, the Elegant Breastplate, that's for level 10. Whispering Shadows. That's for higher level as well. The bandit's crossbow, I think we can get rid of that one. Um, hmm. Required level three. I'm going to hold it. I'm going to hold it because we've got more characters that we're, 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 um, we're building up now. Oh, wait. The secret of the cube. Welcome. Are you interested in the mysterious cube on the table? Yes, it is truly amazing. But I cannot discover its secret. Can you help me acquire some essence? Bring the magician ten elusive essence. Where do we get elusive essence from? We, have, we don't have any at all. Uh, 
I don't even know where to get Elusive Essence from. Oh, I know what that one is. Look, okay. I want to go through here, and this this is going to be the mana thing, right? It's going to unlock the mana thing right there in the resources. So we're going to go through first in Magical Forest. And we're going to just have a quick and easy romp through the Magical Forest like this. And this is going to unlock some essence and some other little bits and pieces. But look at the speed. that just one-shotting everything. This is beautiful. Look. And we're getting the essence as well. Look right there. Elusive essence. A faint trace of a living being's magical nature. And so... Okay, that was pretty epic. Is she even unlocked? Animals are not welcome. 100. I'm guessing it's 100 creatures that we've gone and slaughtered. And there we go. Right. Uh, results right there. Replay. We're going to go through again. Uh, this is... Uh, they're, they're running through really easily. We're doing some... What do we do? Are we doing like fire damage? I'm pretty sure I got fire damage going on here somewhere. I can't remember what was giving me fire damage. There. Three fire damage, 229 nature damage. I'm pretty sure that's just like... Her thing right there, there. Thir plus three fire damage, plus five vampirism. Uh, okay. So I'm not sure what the vampirism is. We'll, we'll see. Hang on. Did she shoot? Is the vampirism, is that like, is she absorbing their um, their health? Well, we're not going to find out. Oh, yeah, we will. We might. If, if, we, if we got one more character, if she takes a shot, let's just see if it... It does! Vampirism. That's actually a really good thing for her to have because of her low health. That is a fantastic thing for her to have. That's absolutely brilliant. Right, relax. 25. So it's not great on the whole relax thing. But we're getting a few more base materials here that we can use so that we can kit out the low level um, dudes on our, like on our other run. So then they'll be able to keep running through here and they'll be able to grind this one um, relatively easily. And then we can go fighting in the bigger one. That's, that's kind of the general idea. Is what, that's, what, that's what we want to do. Um, okay, I'm not. I'm not getting any creatures at all. I'm not. Seriously, one creature across that entire thing. That was it. Just one. Boom, and that's done. Okay. Uh, I'll replay once more. Just the one. We're, we're, this will be the last time now. There. We want some wolf pelts. Those, those would be good, I think. She takes that down. She's had no damage done to her at the moment. So she's not... The, the, the whole vampirism thing is not really an issue right now. The real test will come... We'll take both of these down to the, the next one, which will be the ghoul forest. We, we need lots of ghoul stuff so she can get some better um, gear. And also, he's going to want to start building up some stuff as well. There's another wolf pelt. That'd be good. Take that one out. Boom. Boom. Wolf pelt and last one. Ooh, we've got another gold star. It's a shame it's not a gold star wolf. That's just too easy. Too easy, Master Chief. Too easy. Right. Uh, another competition available. We've got essence right here. I can give 10 essences. Or I can ignore that for a minute. And we can go to the competition. Um, let's go to the competition. Over here. The trendy color is blue. She's got blue. She's wearing some blue. She's got a bit of blue. He hasn't got anything. Right? Seriously, all he's got is grunge. And that's about it. Color, ugly. That's about it. We got blue, we got green. Ugly. Let's send it both off. Let's see what happens. What do we got? She's coming in. She's got she's got the blue on on Nice 20 points. Right on the off, we got 20 points. He's gonna get maybe 10. If he's lucky. Ooh! Okay, I didn't actually expect that. You got 17 points there. That was a pretty good outfit. That was 16 points. One less than us. So we got first and second at the moment. 20 and 17. Oh, okay. They just mopped first. 21 points right there. We had 20. So we're down to second place. 20. But that one there, that was only 15 points. What do you got? What do you got? Are you cool or are you not? Uh, 15, 19 points. I think we've got second place with one and nothing with the other. We have second place. We have second place right there and nothing with Eddie. Eddie never does very well, does he?
Okay, total reputation plus 15. Plus we got these items here. The chestnut logs and the copper ore. That's really good. We want those. Uh, give the essence over here. Welcome. Yeah, 10 elusive essence complete. 300 gold. Thank you. But while this strange thing is certainly magical, no amount of study will unlock its secrets. Perhaps another approach will work. Such must go on. I'm determined to perform another experiment. I've come to the conclusion there's a certain regularity in the number of coloured spots on the cube's faces. I need more essence. Bring the magician 15 weak essence. Mana points. Craft 50 points of mana. Oh, I see. We've got to go in here to craft. There, look. Mana tube. Right there. 10 gold. Two elusive essence. Mana pot. Right there. Weak essence. Trace of a living being's magical nature. Maybe extract from monsters from the battlefield and dark ruins. Mana tube right there. Maybe extract from monsters from the magical forest. Two entirely different things right there. Uh, mana tube and mana pot right there. So I'm going to... Let me craft that one a minute. So I want to bring Eddie. Eddie, 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 yeah. Eddie. You come down over here. you got some work to do, man. you got some work to do. Oh, what about you? The heavy hand. This one. What is this? Unlocks the buff Heavy Hand 1 in the Spa, which increases the damage a character deals. Okay, research that. Uh -huh. uh. That'd be good. Uh, you over here, Eddie, 12%. And we want you to make a mana tube. Right there, we can make one. Craft. That's all I could do. Make one of those. There, that gives me five mana. Five mana points crafted. Okay, uh, I can use spells on the battlefield. I don't have spells. Unless that's the spell. Is this the spell that we're talking about? It could be. Well. Alright, let's drag you over there. And we're just going to go down here. And we're going to relax a minute. Just like that. And then we're going to go here. And we're going to go battlefield. Yes, there's the other. Oh, wait. <gasps> there's one still missing. There's one that we still... There is... No, there's still one missing. Okay, let's go off the let's go off the fight. Let's see what this is all about. What have you got? We've we've got our we've got our new weapons and stuff. We started straight off. We've got weak essence, ancient plate, and a guessing stone, new amulet blueprint right there. Ghost tears, a woodcutter's uniform. Okay, I've got two new blueprints already. This is some very good luck that we've got. Ghoul. Claws, but I've, I, I have no dark skin. It's dark skin that I want mostly. You could do with a potion. There we go. Right. Fantastic. Still no dark skin. And that's a evasion. Yeah, you, you're going to need to drink several of them. Nice. We've got a bit of, of magic ghost tears. Okay, this is good. More weak essence coming in and some leaves. And what do we got finally? One rat. All of that. We got, I mean, don't get me wrong. I got a nice lot of stuff here. But I didn't get the one item that I actually wanted from here. Which was the, the, the last bit. Right, Eddie, unfortunately, he used up a whole lot of his potion. So we'll head back to the village a second. And... Now, what was what, what did I get? I, I got some new woodcutter's uniform here. Ensures that you're well protected from enemy attacks. We need desecrated ingot and we need ectoplasm to be able to do that. A random effect critical increases critical dealt damage dealt with a critical hit and a load of armor as well. So how does that compare to one of those? This physical damage versus that. This is a blue though. That is a blue. So it, you know it, it's good like that. Uh, there was nothing there. What else did we get? Did we get something else? We pick I'm sure we picked up something else. Oh, yes, we did. Uh, it was in this one, wasn't it? Yes, the guessing stone. Helps to solve mysteries. Intelligence, and then a random effect, and we need sorrow stones. I haven't picked out... Oh, craft in the laboratory. That's why we don't get sorrow stones. Uh, we've got weak essence right there. Give essence 6 of 15. Uh, mystery guest... 400 gold. It doesn't know its true value, but we can pay 400 gold for this one. If we want to pay it, give him 400 gold. Who would have thought this traveler takes his leave whistling his songs? You're holding your hand something you could easily have gotten for free. A militia breastplate. Cheater. Great. One militia breastplate right there. 22 and 22. It's not very good. Okay, so we've lost 300 gold on that one. 
Um, I don't know why I just got rid of that. I probably have wanted to keep that for another character in here. But still, what's done is done. We have done it now. We, we may as well just live with our decision. So I've only got two in the area to craft at the moment. Uh, no dark leather. That's what I was hoping for. I didn't get any plank. Did I? I thought I did pick up some logs. Okay, well, I didn't pick up any logs either. I didn't pick up very much. Not really. We got three ghouls, so we do need to go and get some more ghouls. Uh, let's just make sure that we're happy. We are. We're very happy. Everybody's very happy with life. So we're going to go back here to this particular battlefield. Uh, one shot the ghoul, but we didn't get any dark skin. This dark skin seems to have got a horrible drop rate on it. Right? It does seem to be that we get a lot of these turning up. Yeah, finally. Okay, we got some dark skin. That's what we're after. We've got some ghost tears there. We don't have any of the essences yet. Uh, and we got some logs. Okay, good. I want pine logs. There's two pine logs. And we got some more pine logs. That's even better. And we got some ore. This is good. And I think we got one more encounter with something. Oh, we got the dude with the armor. That's going to be like those uh, plate things. We do, yeah, one of those right there. The ancient plate. Results uh, replay. Did I. I didn't actually give him any more health potions, did I? I think I'm going to regret that. Especially if I'm going up against gold star creatures. Ah, I took that out quite nicely. They had dark skin and we got a weak essence as well. We got a little bit more ore. That's good. And some more cotton. That's also good. But the, the cotton, obviously, that's going to be used in the new shop that we've yet to build. We're going to be building it soon. You down. So this the ancient plate. Um, what am I using? The, there is something that we need the ancient plate for. I just can't remember what it is. Another one of these. Hopefully, it's gold star. So hopefully, he will actually drop the dark skin. Oh, yeah. You, you might want a potion there. He didn't. Oh, he did. He dropped one. And we got elegant helmet. New blueprint right there. Results. No, not replay. Go home. Go home. We've got seven ghouls killed right now. We've got another new item right here. The elegant helmet. Look at this. I need two elegant plates. I need two desecrated ingots to be able to make that. That gives me 18 to 24 armor. That gives me 10 to 12. Wow. Group armor. Chris is the armor of all party members. I didn't even know that was a thing. And then a random effect as well. Okay. I'm liking that. And the woodcutter's uniform. Again, this one steals... Seems for it, 280 critical damage. That's pretty intense, but you've got to get the crits. Right, you do have to get the crits. So I'm sort of thinking the woodcutter's uniform might be better on our... Um, on Kazuki rather than on him, because I think that it's going to lower his like, defenses. Okay, we get two from that one, and we're going to get one from that one. Right over here, the band... No, it's, it's the bandit's jacket. That's the one that I want. Uh, critical damage, 200 to 224, 20 to 28 armor from the bandit's jacket. <laughs> Equip. What's she wearing at the moment? She's wearing the scout's jacket and the scout's hat. Uh, she's already equipped the bandit's pants. So it's the scout's hat that she's wearing. Um, Hunter's helmet, though. That's the one that I want. Critical hit chance increase. That's the one that we want. We want to increase critical hit chance as much as we possibly can. Have a look at Kazuki over here. Her total critical hit chance. Um, total power of your character is sum of all types of damage your character plus his or her chance to make a critical hit. This one adds a 19.2% chance of a critical hit. Uh, there's nothing else that increases crit chance. Every attack against an enemy restores five points of your character's health. Beautiful. Vampirism right there. Um, so it's agility. She's already got a 20% crit chance, which is good. That's, that's what you want. For like a, a, a damage dealer like her, you want massive crit chance. That That's going to help a lot. Well, I think it is. Reputation. The higher the reputation in village, the better chances you have getting into the most fashionable contest. We have a competition available here. Uh, let me go and have a look oh, in yeah. here. No competitions available. Really? It says right there, competition available. Submit. Fine. Oh, yeah. do like Trendy color is green. Right. Hang on a minute. 
Go to you. This man robbed some villagers in broad daylight. One of the characters managed to catch him. What should we do? Last time I did rehab, everybody hated me for it. So I'm going to execute him. The robber was sent to be executed at the capital and the peasants rejoice. In return, they give you an old amulet. Black tooth makes you stronger. Okay, that might actually be very, very cool. Um, let me have a look in here. So the trendy color is green. I'm going to take you and I'm going to take you. So you've got some green. Dress to impress, man. You need to dress to impress. Black tooth requires level nine. Once per adventure, deadly damage to the character does not send him or her back to village, but restores his health back to the amount he had two moves before. Plus three physical damage. I lose a load of defense on that uh, if I equip that one, but that requires level nine. Okay. I'll swap that one out so that he's got the green right there. He's got blue. Wait, what? Style blue. Oh, that's a blue one. This one here is grunge. And that one here is casual wear. Plain. That one's blue. And that one's grunge. Uh, so what about you? What have you got? You got green and you got blue. Casual wear and grunge. And you're green and blue. So... She's, she's still got a better chance, even if I'm wearing that one. Right, I get rid of that one. I've got no blue at all on me. I've just got the plain. And I don't even have the grunge. Like, I'm, I'm literally just plain. So I, I will swap the axe in. And then black tooth here, whispering shadows. That they're, they're, they're much higher level. I don't have that. So it's sent. Send these two off. Let's see how we do. Looking at these other guys, there's a lot of blue being worn here. That is just 15 points. That's really low for him. But then we kind of expected him to do badly. Oh, that's only 15 points. That's only 15. Look at this. Look at the, look like, um, <laughs> wow. 25. And look at these guys. These are all wearing, this. they're almost completely kitted out in blue here. Um, that one there was only 19. But they're still better than us. And then this, look at this guy. He's going to do really well. He is. No? Really? 19 again? What about that one? I thought he would have done better. That guy did really well. He did. Five. The color is... Oh, no, no. The color's not blue. The color's green. But still, we didn't do any good. We got fourth place, didn't we? Fourth place and fifth place. Ah. Uh, disappointed. Disappointed. Right. Um... You right here, let's let's put our soldier sword back on. That's the one that we want. We go with you. Can I colour these in? Have I got like an option to do that? That's what I need to do, is I need to make sure I'm wearing that. And the rest of those, we don't do anything with it at the moment. And I'm going to you. You're wearing that one. The bandit's crossbow, that's just plain. Uh this one here is blue. Very schnazzy. Very, very schnazzy indeed. Uh, close that one. Go down here and relax. Heal everything up. And I don't know if I should be keeping some of these. Like Black Tooth. There, yeah, that thing seems really cool. Like, that genuinely seems amazing. Second chance. Once per adventure. Deadly damage to the character. Does not send him or her back to the village. That's like a... That's a boss fight move, that is. That is definitely the sort of thing you want in a boss fight, isn't it? Right, that's, that's going to make a difference. That is. Elegant Breastplate right there. Absorb then 20 stamina on there. The intelligence, I don't think, is going to make much difference. I'm going to hold those... I don't know why I feel I need to. But we want to go we want to go back here to the battlefield. So we're going to fight again on the battlefield and hopefully we can get Well, we're getting rather tired, so it's probably about time we take a break. We're going to go and chill out and relax in the hot tub so that we can recuperate a little bit. In the meantime, if you've enjoyed this episode, could you please head down below and give us a like? And if you really enjoyed it, and please tell your friends all about me, get them to come and watch as well. That would be awesome. And until next time, thank you very much for watching. This is Frithgar. Goodbye, and see you later.